हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू वीएलएसआई एकेडमी दिस इज फिजिकल डिजाइन कोर्स लेक्चर 10 पार्ट 4 ऑन फिजिकल डिजाइन इनपुट्स हियर वी शैल बी लुकिंग एट सम वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग एंड इंपॉर्टेंट कांसेप्ट्स फॉर दोस हु आर इन एकेडमिक्स एंड इन प्रोफेशनल इंजीनियरिंग वर्ल्ड इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी ब्रीफली डिस्कस्ड अबाउट नेट लिस्ट एंड टाइमिंग लिप्स व्हिच आर नीडेड एज पार्ट ऑफ इनपुट टू फिजिकल डिजाइन टीम व्हाट नेट लिस्ट एंड टाइमिंग लिप्स आर वी हैव अंडरस्टूड दैट एंड we have discussed that in the previous lecture link of which is given in the description below today we will discuss about another part that is lef which is also an important part of the library which is needed as an input and we will see what lef is what it contains how to understand it so let's now start it if you ever look at the design this is the standard cell layout of an inverter Ideally, all routing of the standard cell is done in the lowest possible metal layer. You please pay attention here. This is the cell height and this is the cell width. This generally top layer blue color metal is your power rail. So when you place this standard cell in your design, generally it aligns with the power rail and this generally aligns with the ground. So if this is your power, generally this side is your uh drain side and this is your source side and in between that metal is your gate input so this is your physical view of cmos inverter schematic of which we are already aware of and the left file contains the physical view details of all the cells of which timing lib is containing the delay values it means how a cell is physically going to look and the abstract physical view of all such cell will be needed by the design and that is present in the left file so let us further understand what it means left stands for library exchange format it contains the layout view of all the cells and here is the snapshot of layout view of the standard cell so this layout is a stick diagram and it clearly details which is power which is ground and also the pin shapes of input and output and poly and diffusion layer all things are shown in it now here is this abstract view of corresponding layout of the standard cell so this is precisely what left file will be containing in the text format it will mention rectangle details pin type details and direction of the pin and metal but it will not mention anything about further more than that like what are the connections where is the connection or like what is the poly diffusion layer data all that will not be mentioned in the left file now here is the left file content what it contains and we have here layout view and abstract view you can see that this is detailed layout view and we already explained that layout view contains very much lesser details from the layout view and this detail of abstract view of physical stand layout view of standard cell is mentioned in the left file like text like this so what each line contains now let us see that corresponding to the abstract view so it mentions that this is a macro and class core so core means it will be placed in the core with respect to that it is mentioning origin is 0 0 so generally origin is on this side so this is your 0 0 and size is 3 by 12 so generally it means that this is 3 and micrometer i am assuming the unit the unit will be coming from tech file and height would be like this so from here to here it is 12 micrometer that would be your height and then comes the symmetry xy so symmetry xy means your orientation this represents your orientation there are different orientations r0 r 180 mx my and we will see that later on now this site core so that means once it is placed in the core the row will be like going like this so with respect to that it is site core and here the detailing of the layout further starts so we have taken only one pin here but it will have all the pins in detail so first is let's say pin a pin a is this pin so this is mentioned as direction input so this is your input pin pin a and then antenna size 1.4 that would be your gate size of this pin so that would be this one and this is 1.4 and now your port so this is your 
port. Port means that this is not an internal pin, it is an external pin. So external pin means it can be made connections. Connections can be made to this pin and this is your topmost layer pin of this particular cell. It can be used an external connection to the outer world of this standard cell. Then it is routed in layer metal 1. So this pin routing is happening in M1 metal layer and you have rectangle details. So this is your rectangle details of the pin particular pin and then end A. So pin details end here and then furthermore some details and then we have obstruction here. So OBS means your obstruction and the details of obstruction are like this that you have layer metal 1. Layer metal 1 means you, you have here some details like uh, this. This is your one obstruction which is routed in M1 and you have a rectangle detail of that. So these are the details which are mentioned in the left file. These are the contents of left file with respect to this obstruct view we have taken here. That's all for this video. We will come up with more concepts in further videos. Please like, share and subscribe to the channel and give your important feedback in the comment section. Thank you.